John Weir, it's Monday evening, um, we've got a little bit to go just yet, but just talk us through the day you've had today and, and last night as well, and it's been a bit of an exhausting one. Yeah, as it started, I think um, I think they got them up at half six this morning, so we're nearly over, over 12 hours on now, and we've been on our feet for them 12 hours. And it's involved really um, incredible, phenomenal um, fitness testing, phenomenal effort from, from our players. And, uh, I think the staff are sitting around there very proud. Uh, we've got Pete Hart, the club chaplain, who's here, and he says he says it was just incredible to watch. He said his, his words to me is he's never seen anything like it. I think the attitude of our players to never have one moaning when some of the stuff they've done today, I've never, I've never done anything like that, and I'm old school. And um, we knew it'd be that, but for these lads to actually inspire each other and inspire me to do all the runs today and my staff and. It's incredible, and that's the, that's the secret for us to infuse each other and um, see how much we can get out of each other, that extra 5%, 10%. And if we can do that, then and be, knowing that we won that pitch, being the fittest team, it gives you great confidence and belief, and hopefully we can take that into the season. I remember you telling me uh, before you came here that it was going to be a, maybe a, a mix of the old school in some ways, and we saw that with the tyre lifts and things like that and the log lifts, but also um, mixed with that you know, quite a bit of modern thinking in terms of getting the best out of your players. Do you feel you're really seeing a difference then um, with the players? Yeah, not a difference. I, I, I filled some psychometric profiles before I came with, with Phil and sent them up and he was quite shocked. He says, oh, that's outstanding. I think he doubted it a little bit because we're all in fours and fives out of five. And, but I'm hoping he's seen that actually this is a special group. Um, their attitude and their willingness to learn and their work ethic and the willingness to get better is is second to none uh, and that's what we keep saying that we're a, we're a special club and um, we've got some special players and we create a special environment which is why you can you can look at the bits that Luke Lee Hay and Nicky's put out and it, it's great to hear that that we we do that but we we go up to that extra bit because we know they will give it back and this energy balance that we talk about, you can see it today. You guys have witnessed it. It was, it was quite very emotional at times. Me and, me and Peter and all the staff have said that there was some real digging that needed to be done today. There was some real. If you if you weren't up for the fight today, you would crumble. Uh, no one did. Um, and I thought if they did it individually, there's no way that these players could have known that we'd we'd cover that many miles today and be swimming about a mile across Lake Windermere. And, running up that hill which to me I just stood there with my mouth open when he kept sending them up crawling up the hill and giving piggybacks and the burpees that we've done today and all the tests and I think the key objective was to not settle for second best and even if you're winning you notice we kept trying to push them to get the best time so no complacency um, no one taking easy options and all these things as a gaffer is, is something that myself my staff and the club expect from the players that we bring in.